Thank you to the Barrel Consulting Group uh, on this wonderful event. It's been a wonderful conference so far. Great people, great content. Um, I'm Anthony Termini. I'm Senior Vice President of Business Development uh, at Morningstar. I focus on all of our fintech partnerships. And uh, where Morningstar's core business is really supporting the wealth and asset management space, I get to work with all things fintech. So from emerging technology players, the most prominent names in technology, we get to break apart our data analytics and research to build solutions for interesting markets. So it's good to be here. You know, we have uh, an incredible brand at Morningstar, uh, but we also have an incredible mission, which is to simply empower investor success. And so we do that in lots of different ways. Uh, FinTechs love to work with Morningstar because uh, we have an incredible reach and audience and an array of global connections to different data sets across the planet. Um, you know, they come to us for simply elevating transparency, right? They want to shine uh, light on markets and investments and surface new insights and in new interesting ways. Uh, they want to activate investor engagement. So they're all building really interesting apps that they want to trigger alerts and surface insights faster and cleaner uh, for lots of different use cases. And then lastly, uh, fintechs are looking to provide personalization at scale. And to do that, you need incredible technology, but you also need incredible data sets to do that and configure portfolios that align with investor preferences. Yeah, I think, you know, we've seen this incredible uh, explosion of retail activity over the last several years. Um, it's really spawned some new use cases around our research and data that we provide to the market. And as leaders in the industry, you know, we have a duty to support investors, point them in the right direction uh, so that we can provide data and insights too that uh, align with their uh, financial goals. And so uh, with that comes new expectations uh, from these investors, right? They want things bite sized and curated in a manner that's more personalized and unique to the way they want to invest. Uh, so, you know, we've launched many active personalization uh, workflows and initiatives at Morningstar that really enable advisors or investors to really configure portfolios or indexes, kind of to de deconstruct them, you know, from the index or sector level, or just build them from the ground up using our equity and private market databases. FinTechs in different categories, whether it's banking, payments, wealth, or crypto, they're trying to build bridges amongst these different categories. And I think that's gonna fuel um, future use cases and new data needs that will uh, really take us forward to support all different types of investor use cases. What, what I mentioned with convergence of these different industries within FinTech, I think that um, you know there needs to be new layers of insights. Uh, additionally, especially as it comes to the crypto DeFi world, uh, so, you know, when you think about one particular ticker or an investment, right, you can come to Morningstar and get tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands of data sets on that one ticker, right? And when you think about that in other categories, whether it's fractionalized uh, art or cars or other collectibles or NFTs and you get into the DeFi world, you know, that's certainly interesting. There needs to be a broad in more broad data sets, deeper data sets. And then what comes to mind certainly is Web3. You can't stop what's going on in the Web3 category with the interesting business models that are spawning out of that uh, in the way that data is owned and distributed. Um, you know, that's certainly fascinating to me personally.